Jonathan Tisch came from a family of hoteliers. He used that background to become one of the most successful chief executives in the travel and tourism industry. I have really worked at every position in a hotel, and this has been over my early years and traveling with my family of going to properties that were run by Lowe's and really having an early love affair with the hotel industry. As the chief executive for Lowe's Hotels, Jonathan used his creativity and keen business sense to expand the hotel's brand and provide excellent customer and employee service. You have to build a bond not only with your guests, but also with your employees to ensure that your properties are successful and that you can stay competitive in today's very challenging business climate. John's philosophy is to give back to the community and uh, he does it with a passion. Uh, and that's my idea of uh, the very hard impression he's made on the uh, hotel industry. He is on the board of trustees for Tufts University and the board of directors for the New York Giants, Elizabeth Glasser Pediatric AIDS Foundation, Tribeca Film Institute, and the Business Council of the Metropolitan Museum of Art. He's involved in you know, many different uh, associations and organizations, uh, not only just in the hotel industry or in, in uh, you know, NYC and company. Jonathan was instrumental in leading the hospitality industry of New York City during the crisis of September 11. I saw his tireless energy, just boundless energy, bringing us all together, encouraging every one of us, every one of our businesses to do what we could to rebuild New York City, to rebuild New York City's tourism. Jonathan did not only act locally. He was instrumental in the formation of the Travel Business Roundtable, an initiative to strengthen all aspects of the tourism business and show America's government how important the industry is to the nation's success. He's an innovator, uh, coming up with uh, and developing the concept of having a uh, industry forum for working on legislative programs at Travel Business Roundtable that he started in 1995. Uh, it was the first time that the industry really got together to be a voice on Capitol Hill. We are a very diverse industry, and when you understand all the opportunity inherent in today's lodging industry, and you focus on those opportunities and incorporate them in what you can do, then you understand the impact of how successful the industry is today and why it's so important to our country. Jonathan is also an author. In his book, The Power of We, Succeeding Through Partnerships, he discusses how to achieve lasting success through creating partnerships among people, organizations, and communities. But if you read his book, The Power of We, uh, you will find his uh, philosophy of doing business, uh, which encompasses uh, strategic alliances, partnerships, empowering people. Uh, he sort of walks the, uh, the talk that, uh, uh, in his book. Jonathan's contributions to the industry have been recognized by many, including Crane's New York Business, Travel Agent Magazine, and Meeting News. He's used his vast experience to help guide future generations of industry professionals, as well as give guidance to other industry giants. The message is really quite simple. Learn what you do and learn it well. And really try to work in as many different positions in a hotel as you can. The industry has been very good to me, and I think that when I look forward, I will con hopefully continue to contribute to the growth of Lowe's Hotels and also to the understanding of why our industry is so important to this country.